It is our pleasure to welcome Lauren McLean back to Studio B and onto the desk. Lauren with Between the Lines. Welcome, Hello, my Lauren. Friend. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Hey, it's uh, it's always a bright day when you're here, especially <laughs> when we're uh, bright pink or purple or fuchsia. Fuchsia. Oh, fuchsia? I, so I'd like okay. to say fuchsia. All right. What do you have for us today? Well, we uh, took a journey to the Y with Michaela Coolahan from the women's soccer team. She has three goals, four assists on the season so far. Her poison control in the midfield is unparalleled. She's she's definitely one of the best players on the team. So we wanted to get to know her a little bit better. She'd never hiked the Y before. Ah. So, my goodness, what better person to take her up there than <laughs> myself? So let's go Between the Lines. BYU Sports Nation presents Between the Lines. I'm with sophomore midfielder Michaela Coolahan from the women's soccer team, and this is her journey to the Y. You told me you've never hiked the Y before. I never have. Never wanted to, honestly. That's okay. We're going to make you a hiker today. Okay. So tell me, how did you get started in soccer? So I think I was about four years old, and I just started at the rec level. At what point were you or your parents like, okay, she's pretty legit at soccer? <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm still trying to get there. <laughs> what were you like as a little kid? Tomboy, for sure. Really? I wanted to be just like my older brother, always. He called me his little shadow. Are you ready to hike the Y? I the guess first so. time? I guess so. Okay. Let's do it. Was you? See, these are things you've never experienced before. So you went to Davis High School. Yep. Which is an hour north. Way farther this way. And you were kind of legit in high school. It was so fun. Like, we actually won through state three years in a row. So I was with my best friends. We had a super good coach. So it was super fun. In your senior year, you were Miss Utah Soccer. After you found out, kind of, you got all these accolades, what, what was that like for you? You know, it's, it's fun to get accolades, but that's not even what makes it the most fun. Like I said, it's just the experience and living it up, and it was just the best time of my life. We gotta keep hiking. All right, let's, ready go. For this? let's go. We're gonna have a seat here on the bench. Perfect. We wanna get to know a little bit about your personality. Okay. Now, okay? <laughs> so we're gonna do a shootout with 10 questions. I'm gonna ask you 10 questions, see how fast you can answer them. All right. Here we go. Who is your soccer idol? Messi. What is one of your hidden talents? Golf. Which one of your teammates is the goofiest? Cam. Favorite meal? Pasta, maybe? Mm -hmm. Favorite snack? Chips and salsa. Besides soccer, what's your favorite sport? Golf. Last show you binge watched? This is us. Which actress would play you in the movie of your life? Kristen Wiig. Favorite vacation spot? Hawaii. Last song you listened to? Drew Barrymore. I heard you go fishing with your teammates. So we did it um, in the summer, like around camps. And Sabrina talked crap, said that she could catch a bigger fish than me, and none of us caught a fish. <laughs> Let's keep hiking, because we love it. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Let's take one more peek at this view. So what was your recruitment like from BYU when you were in high school? It started my ninth grade year. I narrowed my decision down to BYU and Utah. Then my sophomore year, I committed to BYU. And then um, into my senior year, I was like, do I really want to go to BYU? <laughs> and I actually called Jen. It was right before my what would have been my official visit. Mm -hmm. She's like, just come to the official visit. Just at least do that. So then from there on out, and ever since, I've stuck with BYU and been so happy about it. You never turned back. Yeah, exactly. Well, I'm hot. Let's keep walking. <laughs> I know. Please, I don't. Oh. OK, so came to BYU. You kicked off your freshman season. It was going awesome. And then you get injured. What was that like for you? It was devastating. I tore like all the tendons in my ankle. Oh my gosh. It was a major setback, but I think I learned a lot during that time. So in the end, I'm grateful, although it was really hard. <laughs> we are almost to the Y. Here we are. We made it to the Y. You've accomplished your journey to the Y. First time. What are your goals here moving forward? Our biggest goal is to win a conference championship, so. And for you personally, what, what do you want to see from yourself? I want to help my team in all the ways that I can. I want to be setting my teammates up, helping on defense, just any ways that I can help. That's what I want to do. Look at that selfish attitude. I mean, <laughs> selfish. Let me start that word. Look at that unselfish <laughs> attitude. Well, that's awesome. We've accomplished your journey to the Y. Go Cougs. Go Cougs. <laughs> The 
the women's soccer team continues their journey this Saturday against Pepperdine. Next week on Between the Lines, we're going to get a behind-the-scenes look of the new swimming pool. So follow us on Twitter at BOU underscore BTL and use the hashtag BOUBTL. Love those selfish yeah, soccer a, players. So selfish. You're so, she's they like, I want to do everything for the team. You're so selfish. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, Wait, you, excuse me? Thanks, Lauren. Thanks, Thanks guys.